Productivity is one of the most important things in this world. I mean, without it, we can't do literally anything. We can't accomplish any project. We won't have the motivation to go to the gym. We won't have the motivation to continue a project, go to school, open your business, go to work and anything. So yeah, productivity is really something important. But you know, we all have our limits. But the thing with this limit is that we decided to create this limit for ourselves. What I mean by that is that your limits are only there because you decided that they would be here. And this is caused for a lot of different reasons, procrastination, and it's caused by low dopamine, low testosterone, too much sugar, too much, and all this kind of stuff. This is why to this video, I wanted to be as much productive as possible. What we'll do is that I won't sleep for 24 hours and do as much thing as I can. Of course, this is not something that you should do every day. What I mean by that is that it's not a good idea to just work as much as possible, but I really wanted to try it out for this video because we all have stayed at least once up during the night to, I don't know, study for an exam, continue the work, uh, working on a project, and a lot of different reasons. All of this because we wasn't able to be productive when it was the time to be productive. So tomorrow I wake up around 5 to 7 a.m. to start my journey. So see you tomorrow. tonight still put an alarm at 9 a.m for tomorrow so 24 hours so we'll have to stay up until tomorrow at 9 a.m Now that I made my super protein high calorie drink, plan now is that I have to edit the video that should come in a week. Here is the video that should come in a week, knowing that this video that I'm feeling is going after this one. So this video is called uh, how to sell things on Amazon. I'm showing you how to do print on demand on Amazon. So as you can see, the video is uh, five and fifty-four minutes long, and I'm edit and I'm done editing at this point here, four minutes and eighteen seconds. So almost a little bit less than two minutes left. So yeah, not plan for today is to at least be done with this video, then do the thumbnail, then go outside and buy some energy drinks. Because twenty-four hours, it's not the uh, then we can uh, and it can be kind of sleepy, especially if I stay home. Not go to the gym because you know going to the gym not sleeping is not good. I can start the editing of this video actually, and of course every time I edit a video, I'm always taking a look at the chart on the side. Then also I have to find a short ID video for the one that should come in two weeks because I decided now to stay on a plan like I do one real video and then I do a short, then one real video and then I do a short. Short video are not counted in watch time, but if you look at the analytics, the false fortune of Donald Trump, 936 views. That's a lot of views. Uh, I didn't get any subscribers, I think. Let me just check. Okay, and you got only one of this, but to be honest, 934 views. That's a lot, especially if you compare to the views I usually get on my normal video it's from 70 to 100. So anyway, I edit the video now and see you in a few hours. Two hours later. So we are finally done with the editing of this video. So share, local files, rend, next and done. Now, all I have to do is wait for the video to be rendering. So now that we're done editing the video, and the video is finally rendered, as we can see right here. Uh, I will do the thumbnail. So I don't know where I saw this exactly, but I saw on YouTube that apparently if you implement someone famous in your thumbnail, you get more chance to actually get a little bit more views. So I really wanted to try it out and try to put on Jeff Bezos on my thumbnail to see if this actually works. So this is how the thumbnail will look like. The thing is that I'm not convinced. I don't know if I make it like this or I add the shadow behind me jeff bezos so uh like this or like this uh, shadow behind it looks like it's a bit more natural more professional then i'll change it but at the moment i think i let it like this now the video is finally published so 
I have two choices. I can go to eat or I can write down the script for the short that I have to record and that will get out next week. Because knowing that this video that I'm just that I just did now, this video is supposed to get out this Saturday. Then next week I'm supposed to get out a short. And then in two weeks, this video that I'm recording that now is supposed to uh, get uploaded. I think I'll try to find the first video I did and then we'll go eat. It feel like the whole video will be recorded in front of my computer and working. But anyway, I was doing script of the short that's supposed to get out next week. But uh, I'll go eat and then I'll come back and keep writing the script. And after that, we'll see what we'll do. So we went for a quick food break and then we got back to work. So yeah, see you when I'm done eating. So I'm just done writing the script for the short I'm supposed to record. That should get out next week. But the question that I'm wondering is, do I record it now? Because I'm really tired. I mean, I did a lot of things. We have literally like the whole night. To so should I take a break now and do it later? Or should I just keep working as much as I can, then take a big break? It has been officially seven hours. We waking up and I'm just done doing the miniature of the video for the next week so yeah instead of that i just decided to do the thumbnail for another video uh this one was kind of tricky because the thing on photoshop didn't want it to render good so i had to put white to actually uh, do a good render on it i'm to be honest i'm kind of proud of the result that i got from doing this thumbnail but my brain clearly didn't want to focus correctly due to the fact that it was like the third thumbnail i did to this day and the like second or third video that, that i edited so yeah i did my best to to do it i don't know if i will change it or not but at the moment seems kind of yeah it can be a good one so i think i'll keep it maybe i want to change it during the week but at the moment i think i'll keep it like that <sighs> so i spent some hours just doing stuff on my computer helping family and at the same time drinking some coffee now what i think that what i will do is that i will try to find an idea for the thumbnail of this video at the same time i'll charge my phone and as soon as it charges a little bit because it's already 7 p.m 7 p.m here uh, i'll go outside and buy some energy drinks and before that i have to do the thumbnail for this video i know the whole vlog was literally recorded in front of my computer but anyway this is how it looks at the moment let me show you so as you can see i did my best to try to do something original so 24 hours i don't know how to remove this kind of stuff you know the, the little things here here and here but to be honest i don't think it will seem too much so i think i will let it like this or as you can see all the research i did to find it but anyway, i think it's look good like this uh, what i will do now i'll go outside and buy some energy drinks So, as soon as I went home, first thing I did after drinking some energy drinks, I started the recording third or fourth video of the day, I don't really remember. This was kind of fast because it was a short, the short that went out last week, I think, related to the top five richest investor in the world. The top five richest investor in the world. So the place number five we have... St so... We crossed the 13 hour, so this means that we have 11 hour left. We did already a lot of things today. I wanted to go to the gym in the morning, but I didn't do it because, you know, not sleeping the day you go to the gym is clearly bad for the body. So I didn't go to the gym. Instead, I just recorded a lot of video. We didn't have any trade. I really wanted to enter position in live, I mean, during the vlog, but didn't have any valid entry for today. So yeah, we already did three thumbnails, two video. We edited one video, are recording another video now. It was kind of productive, but we still have 11 hour left and we'll see what we'll do during this time it is 2 a.m in the morning so seven hours left technically uh, to be honest i didn't do too much for the last three hours for the last two hours uh, i've been just playing on my computer uh, i think I'll get, back to, I'll get back to work soon i have a video to edit then yeah we'll see we have the energy to do that we still have one energy drink left so yeah no, seriously we didn't do a single thing during the whole night uh, all i did was literally playing we already did a lot of things during the days but during the night it just feel 
Like, I'm more focused on not, not sleeping that now than uh, not accurate trying to be productive. I guess that it wasn't that hard to guess, but sleeping is important for your productivity. Anyway, time to play some Valorant and uh, see you in a few hours. At this moment, I don't know exactly how much time it was left, but I was feeling really, really tired. Didn't have any motivation to do anything. So I just spent two, three, four hours, I don't even really remember just playing video games and the worst of that is that most of the games that i played in valorant i actually lost them so it wasn't even worth it to do that but yeah i know that it was less than five hours left so i just had to keep going because it was really close to our final goal seriously i really tried to actually do the editing uh, and do the other stuff but you know my brain is just too bad at the moment i have no idea no originality to actually be able to do a good editing so it's better to actually not do it instead of do something bad at this moment it was 7 a.m and the sun started to rise i know that 24 hours isn't that much to be honest not sleeping but the fact that i was trying to become to be as much as productive during this day made the thing way more hard than what i thought than just you know playing video games going out having fun and this kind of stuff so three hours left i think i'll just go to bed and uh, wait to sleep until the final hour. Three days later. <laughs> no, seriously, I remember shutting down the alarm that I placed, using my iPad, putting it on the desk, taking off my glasses, putting it on the desk. I'm not sure if I slept a little bit earlier than that or not, because remember the time was like 8.30, 8.45, and it's like, and it's like the last memory that I've had. Just after that, I remember just being waked up, I would say maybe, of the alarm at 9.30 that I placed for the 24 hour timer. I don't know if that counts. I don't know if I didn't sleep for 24 or 23 hours, but anyway, I was still able to do a lot of things during this time edited, filmed, and did the thumbnail for like three videos or so three weeks of video. So still productive, I would say, even if drinking energy drink the whole day, coffee, I'm very tired and at the same time working isn't healthy and good for the brain. Of course, doing that is not a good idea, but you know, it was still interesting to see how long could we be productive for 24 hours. So yeah, sleep is something really serious that you need to take in consideration in your daily life. I mean, that's not, so I'm not learning you something new now. So thanks again for watching this video. If you like this video, subscribe. If you didn't like, don't subscribe. But anyway, thanks for watching it. And of course, have a good day.